Oh, no. Turn and face the... Maya, sit. You keep breathing in my face. That feels really good. Get over here. You're being uncooperative. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to do another subscription box unboxing. And today's unboxing is actually going to be for Pup Joy, which is a monthly pet subscription box. I was fortunate enough to have Pup Joy send me this box for review. So Kaya and I are going to open up this box and we're gonna see what's inside and we're going to see if we like what's inside, which as we all know, Kaya loves everything. She is circling me like a shark. You're gonna sit over there. I need you over here. Well, it's better than nothing. Anyways, so I'm gonna make sure to put down in the description box below all of the information about Pup Joy, like the price and everything like that. So make sure that you check it out if you're interested. But without further ado, we are going to get into the Pup Joy box. Thank you. All right, so I'm gonna start off with some cookies. <gasps> some treats and cookies. First thing, Maya. So the first thing we got is a big bag of treats and this is from Bo's Bones and these are organic gourmet dog biscuits and they are called Love and Hearts, only the best for your dog with love. So we're gonna give Kaya one of these and see what she thinks. All right, Ooh. I'm gonna smell it first. Nah -ah -ah. Wow, those actually smell really good. You want it? Easy. Okay, so Kaya ate that like incredibly fast, like the whole cookie. So this is a really good sized bag of dog treats, organic, very delicious, Kaya approved. Do you approve? Well, Albie's here too, good. Gang's all here. Alrighty, so we're gonna get back into the box and see what else we got. We have another full size bag of dog treats here and these are from Be Positive and this is oven baked dog biscuits and they are made with love. Well, that's just adorable. That is another full size bag of dog treats and these ones are in cheese pizza flavored. What do you think about that, Kaya? You like pizza? Yes, we love pizza. So I'm gonna open these up, give Kaya one. You want one? Ah, ah. Easy. Leave it, leave it, leave it. She's just drooling. She's drooling, okay, take it. Another successful treat, she ate that very, very quickly, and this is a full, like, full bag of dog biscuits. Like, there's a ton in here, so that's gonna last us a long time. Pretty good, huh? We've got one more thing of treats, and this is a big box of dog treats, and these are called Betty Bye with Green Tea and Ginger Organic Dog Biscuits. They are wheat, corn, and soy free. So it doesn't say a specific flavor on it, but once again, this is a big box of dog treats, so. We're gonna open it up. We're gonna see what Kaya thinks, if she'll sit still long enough. She hasn't done a video in so long. She forgets how to sit still. Okay, ready? Loves it. You love it? Was that good? I didn't smell that one. I don't know what they, they don't really have a smell actually. It would taste one, but I'm not really into eating dog food, you know? So there is another full size bag of treats. So that is three full, like full, full size bags of treats right there that you're getting. And now we're gonna move into the toys. So this box comes with two toys and the first one here is called Jack for Joy. And this is a, like, it's super hard. So this one says that it is delightfully durable. It's Jack for Joy and built to last, fun to fetch and easy to clean. So this, it almost feels like a glass. So it really doesn't feel like she's, I mean, it's not glass obviously, but it does not feel like it's something she's gonna be able to rip apart. Kaya, come here. What do you think? So this isn't typically the kind of toy that Kaya likes, but it might be fun to play fetch with, but this isn't something that she would like pick up to play with on her own, but that's pretty cool. Something very durable, which we need for Miss Munchie over here. And then we have one more thing, and this thing I know Kaya's gonna love, and it's another toy, one of Kaya's favorite types of toys. It is a rope duck. Kaya loves rope. Tug is her favorite and it's called Huggle Hounds. At Huggle Hounds we love happy dogs. So this like I said doesn't have a no squeaker but rope is good so it loves to play with ropes. Come on. 
Like Tug is Kaya's best thing. We also got a cat in our box. That's a pretty good prize. That's like the free gift that comes with purchase. She just climbed in there and then she climbed out. Okay guys, so that is everything that we got in the Pup Joy box. It was a fantastic box, like high quality toys and treats and really full size treats and everything. So Kaya seems to enjoy everything, but we all know Kaya does enjoy everything. I'm very very impressed and Kaya too is very impressed she just keeps looking at the duck hey guys I just wanted to give you a little bit more information about pup joy because there is while well, Kaya is in the background playing with her stuff <laughs> she's dragging that duck all around so there are a few different things about pup joy that are not similar to other subscription boxes and they gave me a list of things that you guys might be interested in knowing about this so I am going to read those to you the first thing is that they don't focus on theme so they don't have a monthly theme every month you won't find any sample sizes or anything with an inflated retail price so no explainer cards that are giving you any false details about my butt hanging out <laughs> I won't. Okay. No cards with any inflated prices, like what you see is pretty much what you get. They also have a personalized ordering process. So all the products that you're going to receive for your dog are going to be tailored for your dog. So it's not just whether or not like they're a big dog or a small dog. It also takes into consideration if they have any sensitivities. So if they are gluten intolerant or dairy intolerant, or if they have any sensitivities to beef or grain, anything like that. And then they do have the all organic box. So that is the box that I received was the, was the, I think was the all organic box. Their website, website. <laughs> their their web, <laughs> website is pubjoy.com. Oh my god, I'm having a rough day today. Get it? Rough day? Because of dogs? Anyways. What do you mean? I don't get it. It's a dog subscription. Rough day. What's, what does that mean? Rough. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh Anyways, the website is pupjoy.com. Their monthly prices range from $23 to $44 a month. They do ship to Canada as well for $5 shipping, which is really, really good because usually the shipping is what really guts you when you're in subscription boxes for Canada. So this is the only personalized, all natural artisan box that you can receive that is for your puppies. This is the only box that offers you with options for sensitivities, so like food sensitivities, as I mentioned before, and it is the only box offering monthly, bi-monthly, and quarterly delivery options. So you don't have to get this box every month. You could do it bi-monthly or you could do it quarterly, which is kind of good because with other pet subscriptions, I found that, for example, when I got Bark, Bark, box it would come every month and then we would have so many like dog treats like there's no way Kaya could have eaten all that so it's pretty good too if you want to save a little bit of money and do it bi-monthly or quarterly like that's an option and they're the only ones that do that and they are the only box with a 100% satisfaction guarantee so if you don't like what you see you get your money back pretty good and they also offer risk-free ordering so you can skip renewals or cancel subscription at any time without penalty and they work directly with small artisan manufacturers and they curate from the top companies industry and introduce customers to new high quality brands and products they are a socially conscious company and they support small businesses in helping you give back to programs supporting breast cancer and animal rescue so that is a lot of information I know, but I think it was important to mention a lot of that if that is something that interests you, especially if you have a dog who has food sensitivities. Luckily for me, Kaya can eat like a bag of garbage and it won't affect her. I'm not kidding, she ate a bag of garbage once, like pen caps and everything. It was it was kind of gross, but you know, she's got like a stomach of steel. So if you do have a dog though who is sensitive to a lot of foods, then maybe this is the box for you. So hopefully Kaya will be in a few more videos coming up because I think we have a few more things coming her way. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you see, please subscribe and we hope to see you guys again soon. Say goodbye Kaya. Goodbye. Do you love it?
Kaya hasn't put this thing down since she got it. You love it? Nom, 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 nom. Emma! Yeah, you already ripped the head off. I guess you do love it. Did you eat it, Kaya? She already ripped the head off of this toy. And I think she ate it. Come here. Kaya, come here. Come here, quick, 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 quick. Come here. No, come here, quick. Kaya, come here, quick. Kaya, come here. Nobody can see your face. Turn around. Hi, you knocked the camera. Prove? Well, Albie's here too. Good. Oh my God. Albie! What's your flavor? Having a real rough day. Woof, woof. 